If I asked you the question, what would you create more of in your life? What would you answer? I'm Steve McKay, cognitive hypnotherapist, and I'd just like to share five brief um, ideas to give you uh, some, some food for thought around creating more of what you would want in life, apart from winning the lottery, of course. Um, first of all, know what you want. So many people find it very easy to describe what they don't want, but twist it around, flip it, and ask yourself, what do you really want in life? And what would you want to create in life? Um, and perhaps think about what you're tolerating that you want to do something about. Number two, we're either in growth or protection. So make a decision. Um, it's your choice as to whether to stay in protection, which is a very pre comfortable feeling, staying exactly where you are, but not growing. And growth, by definition, is moving forward, challenge yourself, pushing yourself outside of that comfort zone and perhaps learning something new. Um, it's your choice. But yes, growth can feel uncomfortable at times, um, like learning something new, but it moves us towards exactly towards the life that we want. Um, number three is all about setting unrealistic goals. And it sounds a bit counterintuitive to set goals that you feel are re unrealistic, but um, realistic goals don't allow you to achieve anything beyond what you're doing at the moment. And believe me, you are capable of so much more than you believe you are at this moment. Um, number four is feel the fear and do it anyway. Fear is a concern or a worry about the future. Um, it's not reality, but just come back to here and now. And because you already have all the tools and resources and the innate ability to do what you want to do, um, just going with that fear and pushing yourself out there. And finally, trust your inner wisdom and not your thinking. Um, thoughts are very spontaneous. You have no control about your thoughts. Um, if I ask you not to think of a pink elephant, you cannot not think of a pink elephant. So just allow thoughts to, to come in. Um, but really trust your inner wisdom. Listen to your gut and your heart rather than your head. Hope you found this useful. I'm Steve McCabe, cognitive hypnotherapist. Speak to you soon. Bye.